Welcome to St. Mary's. Here are the top three things for this week you need to know. I'm Jane Miller. This is our bookstore. This is Faye Dean. And we welcome you to St. Mary's and our bookstore. We have a soft opening for the last six weeks. The bookstore is open two mornings a week, 10.30 to 12.30. But all the rest of the week, all four carts are outside for browsers to buy from. And they put their money in these envelopes, in this mailbox, on the honor system. We have hand sanitizer. It is very safe. People are told to wear their masks and only two are allowed at a time in the front room. We are very low on hardback fiction because during the pandemic, instead of buying two or three books, people are walking out with 10 books. So please, if you have hardback fiction, please donate it. About three times a year, we have a book sale for 10 cents, 25 and 50 cents that stays up for about three weeks, a couple of times a year. Let's go look at the sale table. The three sale tables are heavily used books that we have priced from 10 cents, 25 and 50 cents. And they are cooking, travel, religious, self-help, health, yoga, Shakespeare, puzzles, uh, everything you can imagine are on these three tables. And these are open all night, all weekend, all day, and they pick up their envelopes and put it in the outside mailbox on the outer system and it works. Let's go to the bookstore. When you come in the bookstore, you will see right away the mailbox. And this is where you put your money in here on the honor system and you go push, push, push. Right now we have a great selection of Florida books. We have two books that are on the bestseller list that were published last year. $36 book for $5 and Chris Wallace's 1945 Adam Bomb book last year for $4. Here is the entire nonfiction here. This is religious. This is classic. More of our hardback fiction, the last that I have. Coffee table books for very low prices. Four spindles that Faye keeps marked and filled all the time. And these are face out because we are low on hardback fiction and we would appreciate it. Thank you very much. Oh, I'm the business person here. <laughs> so I'm introducing myself all over again. I'm Paula Dean, and I'm from Gaithersburg, Maryland, but I live here with you all now. It's stewardship season. And we're for this week, the Lord's up unstoppable mission. If you are into the sermon series, uh, you will, there is a prayer on stewardship. And if you're having problems with anything with concerning stewardship, give the office a call and they will send you a pledge card. And our other interesting major subject is a, is a celebration supper. It will be digital this year. Now, when you come to get your digital dinner, I'm wondering what it might be. We will be having a fellowship online experience that will celebrate St. Mary's on January 30th at 6.30. Stay tuned for registration and more details. Now the third most important thing is annual meeting will be in, on January 31st 
after the 10 o'clock service. The meeting will take place in Ross Hall. Please register online so that you may be present to vote and hear about the exciting developments at St. Mary's. Thank you. These are the top three things we all need to take notice of. Thank you so much for letting us do this and do come in and browse in the bookstore. In February, we're going to take you into the library with Jeannie DePel, our librarian of religious books.